I'm Chief Inspector Alex Butterfield from North Yorkshire Police. I lead uh, on the Specialist Operations Department and have a responsibility for road safety. And is that, how does that work with, um, I think people are very wary of like traffic police because they see it on television quite a lot. Is that an area of road safety? How does it actually knit together? So, so all police officers that are operational will come into contact with road traffic collisions and what we try to do is deploy the uh, the nearest resource to help resolve that situation if it requires a police attendance but what we've got in addition to that is we have something called a department called rpg which is our road policing group which is a team of officers that work 24 hours a day who respond to the slight and serious injury collisions and also fatal collisions to do that important scene work and as begin the investigation in relation to post collisions uh, so we can get answers to the families and those that are injured of why that collisions occurred and make sure that if there are offences that those offences are investigated and people are brought to justice but in addition to that we have a preventative approach and in North Yorkshire Police we take uh, road safety very seriously uh, and we have a road safety a small road safety team to complement that RPG uh, traffic cop team um, with prevention work and we are data led so we have a dedicated uh, analyst who examines collision data over a period of time and identifies key routes for us to be uh, patrolling on and take necessary action uh, and those officers on a daily basis will patrol those routes uh, to do that preventative looking for uh, opportunities to engage and enforce uh, with members of the public who are committing offences uh, that are offences that are normally contributing factors to collisions. And I think it's fair to say most most people are kind of aware of enforcement it could be like speeding it could be like on motorbikes like number plates it could be just dangerous driving but I think people are not always familiar with the preventative work that you do because obviously the main the aim is to not go to any incidents Absolutely. Could you just tell us a bit about the work that you do to stop the accidents in the first place? So it's that education piece. It's been being on the roads and influencing rider behaviour and driver behaviour on those key routes uh, and having that presence to make people think, oh, the police are on this ro road, I must drive to the conditions, I must drive to the, uh, to the law. Uh, but in addition to that, we engage with certain groups, whether it's local schools around road safety, uh, military establishments uh, and, and other, other groups to get key messages across to ensure that people are safe when using the road network. And that, is it fair to say that engagement is, is about education, not you know, convincing people why they shouldn't be speeding or driving in a certain way? And is that, does that kind of lead us on to the, to the motorbike behind you? Is that kind of a key part of that? Yes, yeah, so in North Yorkshire, because we've got 5,000 miles of road uh, and those roads are, are challenging for uh, riders of motorcycles, they want to come here on a, from a, for a leisure ride uh, and enjoy North Yorkshire. And we don't want to deter them from coming. We want them, people to visit North Yorkshire and, and, um, and ride on our roads, but we want them to do it safely. We want them to drive to their ability and to the conditions. One of the reasons um, that one of the approaches that we're taking is investing in such a, a machine as the uh, Kawasaki H2 Ninja, which is an unmarked bike uh, and is the, um, is the performance bike of choice. That is an engagement tool as much as it's uh, an enforcement tool, is to get a conversation starting with the riding community to be able to um, talk about road safety uh, and improved rider behaviour so we're, we're able to um, uh, advise on uh, rider behaviour and sign them up for things like bike safe which is uh